Navigation databases for GNS or HT systems that use PCM CIA cards can be updated by downloading the new databases from the Honeywell website. Once the new database is downloaded to your computer, it can be transferred to a PCM CIA card, which is then used to load the database to the aircraft. In this video, we'll show you how to download a new navigation database to your computer and then upload it to your aircraft. Before you download a database, you'll need to install the OneNav Plus software as well as the drivers for the OmniDrive. OneNav Plus is software that is used to download the navigation databases, and the OmniDrive is used to copy the new databases to a PCM CIA card. If you haven't done so already, install OneNav Plus and set up the OmniDrive. To update a navigation database, we'll first download the new database to a computer and then transfer the database to a PCM CIA card. This process takes about five to 10 minutes. To download the database to your computer, we'll use OneNav Plus. Ignore the message about a trial version. The OneNav Plus database download feature is free for all GNS customers. So you don't need to register if you're just downloading a database. Select Make Nav Database. Continue to the File Manager. Click on Download Database. You will now be directed to the download area. Log in with your user ID and password. Read any alert messages that may pop up and then close the window. Read through and accept the license agreements. On the left side of the screen is the database identifier. Make a note of this identifier in your records. You'll need to refer to it in case you need technical assistance. Under the associated docs view, you'll find a content letter in PDF form. Download the letter and save it wherever you'd like. Always review the content letter to see if there have been any database changes in the new cycle. After reading the letter, go back to OneNav Plus and download the database. Once the download is complete, the file manager will be displayed and the new database will be shown. Once the database is downloaded to your computer, you're ready to copy it to the PCM CIA card. Plug the Omni drive into your computer. Next, we'll insert the PCM CIA card. Make sure that the arrow on the card is pointing up and in towards the drive. The downloaded database will be shown on a line in OneNav Plus. Click on the line so it's highlighted. Then right-click and select Make Nav Database, and then Create PCM CIA. Once the database transfer is complete, eject the card and shut down all programs. You are now ready to transfer the new database to the aircraft. Once you have the new database copied to the PCM CIA card, you're ready to upload it to the aircraft. We'll show you how to upload a database to a GNS XLS system using an 8 megabyte card. Your system might vary slightly. PCM CIA cards have a write protect cutout on one side of the card. Insert the card into the FMS making sure that the write protect cutout is on the same side as the eject button. Once the card is in, turn the FMS on. Once the self-test is complete, use the left line select keys to select 1 to begin the update. Push Enter on the keyboard and the update will begin. Update times vary based on the size of the database. 
The screen displays the progress of the update. Databases that are uploaded prior to the effective date will take effect at 9.01 Zulu on the effective date. If the aircraft is airborne at this time, the new database will take effect after the next power cycle. Once the update is complete, push Enter to restart the system. Once the self-test is finished, the update process is complete. If you use a 20 megabyte PCM CIA card, the card must remain in the FMS at all times. If you use an 8 megabyte card, you can remove the card from the FMS or leave it in until the next update. When performing a download, if your computer doesn't recognize the Omni Drive, try a different USB port. If that doesn't work, the Omni Drive may not have installed correctly. Reinstall the Omni Drive software and make sure to plug in the drive at the appropriate time during the install. If you have any trouble with the PCM CIA card itself, contact Honeywell. You should never have to reformat the card. For more troubleshooting steps, refer to the document titled GNS HT Database Downloading Instructions. For questions or issues regarding OneNav Plus, contact the Honeywell OneNav Plus group at onenav at honeywell.com. For account-related questions, please contact your account management representative at 602-436-6739. For technical assistance with the PCM CIA cards, or if you have any issues loading the database to the aircraft, contact Honeywell Aerospace Technical Support.